two is a singles match. Super Rumble. Introducing first, heading from Chokeslam Town. He is half dinosaur, half luchador, and he's here to remind you that life finds a way. This is Lucha Introducing his opponent, wrestling out of Sin City, Las Vegas, Nevada. Weighing in this evening at 265 pounds, he's known as the Tool Man, Killer Cross! right here at Bar Wrestling match number two, Luchasaurus taking on Killer Cross. This is a battle of two behemoths. Like I, you know, I knew, I always knew Killer Cross was a pretty big man. I did not realize he could stand eye to eye with Luchasaurus. Yeah, he, I was, I actually was unaware of that. I mean, Luchasaurus is our resident big lizard. He's our resident giant. Oh man, they're throwing some stiff shots right away. Killer Cross though, gets the better of those elbows. Oh, and a kip up. Wow, super kick. Educated feet. Or claws. German suplex, and Cross gets right up to his feet. Looks like it just got Cross going. Get the adrenal glands pumping. That's Inside just out clothesline. No, I don't think Luchasaurus is used to getting in the ring with somebody the same size as he is, the same height, the same build. This is going to throw his game off a little bit. Usually when Luchasaurus kicks somebody in the face twice, they're dead. Uh, the fact that Killer Cross is still alive and standing and thriving is a shock to pretty much anyone watching, me included. You know, we've seen Luchasaurus get in the ring with smaller opponents. Opponents that are quick and agile, that, 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 that work a, a, a very Lucha Libre style. I think you're going to see a different side of Luchasaurus here with Killer Cross. Yeah, I mean, he's, you know, he could go toe to toe with Killer Cross, but he might want to just dip into his bag of Lucha tricks. Choke slam on the apron. No, not a Lucha trick. No, just just a straight up power move right there. Well, that's some good old fashioned American pro wrestling. Uh, wasting no time. He's taking Killer Cross very seriously. As for those of you watching at home, the apron is the hardest part of the ring. There's a big boot. I don't care what Jim Cornette says. Killer Cross now in a bad way. He's a little bit dazed, but he's not off his feet. He's still standing. With the shoulders. Killer Cross ducks out, kicks him right in the stomach. Float over DDT from Killer Cross. Advance, attack, annihilate, say the trunks of Killer Cross. Luchasaurus, meanwhile, half man, half dinosaur, all zombie. You know, before the match, the fans were chanting that Cross is gonna kill you to Luchasaurus. Is it for some sort of foregone conclusion? Uh, I don't know that they have the authority to make that call. I don't know why they were so certain of that. Ooh, running clothesline, you felt that one. Killer European Cross. uppercut. Killer Cross is definitely in control right now, but I wouldn't say he's killing anybody. Oh my god. Jeez. Dumps Luchasaurus on his head. Killer Cross just highlighting his power, his stature. Things are definitely in his. Killer Cross. Oh my god, I think the ring just broke. Ooh. Another clothesline that turned Luchasaurus inside out. Things are going. Killer Cross is way right now. Now, did you see the ring move when Killer Cross hit the ropes? A couple inches, yeah. How much do you suppose he weighs? Killer Cross, he's a good 230. That guy is just covered in muscles, covered in tattoos, covered in definitely the aftermath of murder. I would imagine Killer Cross murders people in their cars, probably gets them in their homes. Ooh, and there's a knee lift from Luchasaurus. I don't know that Killer Cross has ever murdered a dinosaur. It was the first time for everything. Knee lift from Killer Cross. Both men are down. I, you know, I don't know if there's a more apt name in professional wrestling than Killer Cross. Gets right to the point. But again, 
again, I, I wonder if Killer Cross is more of like a premeditated murder guy, if he's like a, a manslaughter guy, you know, if he runs people over with his car. Oh, it's not obvious. Looks like he's a home invasion kind of guy. Yeah, that's what I thought. I thought. Yeah. Like a ski mask or a stocking cap and a quick death. Or maybe like a quick death if you're lucky. Killer Cross with an open hand chop, and there's one from Luchasaurus. That was more of an open hand punch. Wailing on each other in there. But Luchasaurus is not ready. Lock, He's back kick. Luchasaurus side is not, kick. Is not ready to go extinct just yet. Ooh, Cross has it by the neck. He's got to know Luchasaurus is from Chokeslam Town, though. Head scissors no spike. Longer, no longer from the La Brea Tar Pits. I guess if you're sending him mail to La Brea Tar Pits, it's going to get returned. Yeah, it's definitely going to get returned. You want to redirect that to Luchasaurus at Chokeslam Town. He is on the corner of no, Cranberry Drive. No, no you're all. Uh, no, that's somebody else. Yeah, that, no, no, that's. Don't get it confused now. There's a choke slam on Killer Cross. And I think for the first time this match, Killer Cross looks like he's worse for wear. Standing moonsault from the very heavy Luchasaurus. Now, wait a minute, wait a minute. Something's going on up here on the stage. That's Scarlet Bordeaux. You no, know, I was going to say that that is where Luchasaurus does have the advantage. He has, he has the agility advantage in this contest. But so does he have the same want and need as every human man? Well, most human men. Jeez. Don't get distracted, Luchasaurus. Don't let this siren sing her song, Luchasaurus. Did he just say, I'm going to take a bite? He said, chokes it. Scarlett Bordeaux doing her best to woo the Luchasaurus away from Killer Cross. How does she have in that bucket? Come on, referee Rick Knox. Oh no, referee Rick Knox is down. Ow! Ah! Damn! She just smacked him with a bucket. Killer Cross with a side suplex. Dumps Luchasaurus right on his head. And now locking in the submission right in the middle of the ring. And Luchasaurus taps, that's it. Thanks to the interference of the very attractive, very seductive Scarlet Bordeaux, Killer Cross is the winner.